Baruch Hashem, today is day number 95 of our daily study of Ramam Sefer Mitzvahs. And we are continuing in the three chapters a day of Mishnah Torah with uh, the laws of kashrus, of kosher food, what we call hilchas maicholais asurais, and that uh, specifically chapters 2, 3, and 4 today. Okay, corresponding to that, we have three positive commandments today and two negative commandments. Five mitzvahs in total. Let's go through them. Positive commandment 150, to inspect birds for their kosher signs. Remember yesterday we had the positive commandment to investigate and to identify the kosher signs of a, of a domesticated mammal. Okay, so this is to inspect fowl before consuming them to ascertain that they possess the qualities that are characteristic of non-kosher birds, to make sure that they are not non-kosher birds. Now, the Torah doesn't specifically give us signs, but it gives us a list of the species that are forbidden. The Rabbah mentioned something interesting, that although we're not given specific signs of non-kosher birds, however, if you go through the list of non-kosher species, you can find certain common denominators that are shared by all of them, which are non-kosher signs. Positive Commandment 151, to inspect grasshoppers for kosher signs. You're saying to me, what? What grasshopper is kosher? Well, you probably haven't experienced it. I've never seen one in my real life either, and let alone eat one. But there is such a thing. It does exist. Apparently, they have jointed leg-like extensions above their regular legs. And uh, that's the sign to look for. Uh, probably look for a heksher, a good heksher before you consume uh, any grasshoppers. Okay. Positive commandment 152, inspecting fish for their kosher signs. What are the kosher signs of fish? Fins and scales. Okay. Negative commandment 172 is the prohibition against eating any mammal that does not have the kosher signs. Don't eat those animals that don't have the kosher signs. Okay. Negative commandment 174, the prohibition against eating the birds that are not kosher. Any of the birds on the list, we don't, you know, the, the non-kosher list. In Parshas Shmini and Parshas Re'e are the two places. Don't eat any of those birds. That's negative commandment 174. Okay. We have more kosher-related mitzvahs over the next few days. We'll see you again, God willing, tomorrow.